What's up, mother frickers? Welcome back to the class. We are now in session. My name is Jake from Esports Talk. What's your name? That's super cool. And welcome back to a video where I need all of your responses because I think we could be looking at the future of streaming, at least for some world class and top streamers out there who have the funds necessary to make that next step of this VTubing thing taken to a next level. Now, I actually saw this this past week thanks to Miko. I'll try and link some tweets down below for all of you guys of what has been around for a while. Now, especially when you look towards the Asian scene and region, they are often a few steps ahead of the game. And I'm gonna ask all of you guys, is this the future for at least some streamers out there? It very well could be. It's just a, it's a weird thing to look at. Do any of you guys remember? Now this is why class is in session. I got some questions for all of you guys, especially all of you, uh, you know, you hardcore viewers out there. Do any of you guys remember Project Melody? At some point, in, oh, actually a while, while back, I think she was actually banned for this kind of VTubing technology, which was taken to um, maybe a provocative level. Do you guys remember that? Uh, I will ask you another question. Do you remember Dr. Disrespect with RoboDoc and when he, when he tried this? He will be here. In the meantime, you're looking at the six foot eight carbon fiber steel out of control international robotic champion by the name name Robo 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 Doc 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 I have you on the surveillance doctor Ladies and gentlemen, don't believe doctor. I'm, t I'm the one that's taking care of him. Then I'll ask you a further question. Pokimane even experimenting this past year, 2020, been been a wild ride, especially for Pokimane, right? You guys remember when she entered the VTube scene and the VTubing community was like really upset as most people get with Pokimane, huh? Hi. And now we got this most recent tweet which brought to light this video because I want to ask you guys Do you think this is the future because I certainly think we'll see the higher end of streamers dibble and dabble and tip their toes Or dip their toes uh, rather into this kind of thing because if you got the money and you can actually reap the rewards from You know donations or income in your streams These things are certainly not going to be accessible to all streamers out there, but brought to us by Miko This is actually a suit apparently called the x -Send suit uh, Thanks to replies out there apparently the sensors are actually actually in her jacket and we've now seen several clips of her doing this which is just it's really throwing me off realizing that I used to watch Tim the Tatman or Bodie way way back in the day and now I could tune into a stream for the first time ever and and see this look at that now my face is moving Nico's face is moving and that's that's pretty much um uh... oh, let me pull it back a little bit oops oops Hi! Hi, everybody! <laughs> no, no, my, my password is not 12345. Okay, that's not my password. So I'm gonna show you guys some features um, as I am uh, doing this whole mining thing. My chat tells me it looks like Hassan, and then look, watch, watch this. Okay, look. Hello, Will Death. Whoa! Hello. Here, pa pound your desk and say, Weasley Little Liars. Weasley Little Liars! liars. And then say, still lying. Still lying. <laughs> very good. Very, very good. close. Very good. Very good. Yes. It's, like I'm in the, it's like I'm in the room with him. And so, I don't know. I see these clips sometimes and I think maybe, maybe uh, the lads and ladies over at Esports Talk would want to talk about this. And sometimes I just throw a video out there. So if you guys do enjoy it, you know, feel free to answer the question. Do you think this could be the future for a few Twitch streamers or YouTube streamers? I really do think so. If I look towards an iconic example right now, I would say Valkyrie Ray for 100 Thieves. I, I could certainly see her giving this a try right down her alley, especially with her audience. I think they would do very well with this kind of thing. It certainly 
certainly wouldn't be for all streamers out there, but I think we will see some actually try it out if they can't afford it. And there will be a lot of variety in these kind of uh, gear setups and of course these suits used. And again, there has certainly been other cultures and regions of the world who have already seen this, but if it comes a, a thing over here in Western culture, who's gonna use it? Who would it not work for? Who would it work for? I'm just always uh, interested to pick your brains out there about the future of VTubing taken to like the next step and the next level. It's wild. What do you guys think? It's next time, huh? You know what to do. Take a sip. I'll see you back here sometime soon. Take care.